What up? My name is Brad. Welcome to Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer. And the reason that I picked Soul Silver is because I couldn't think of anything else to really fucking play. Sorry about the little white line above the bottom screen. It'll fade in in a second. Um, I couldn't think of anything else to play. I was like, I played Conquest, and I can't play Conquest anymore because I just know it too well. It's boring. You know what I mean? It's just, ugh. It gets old so quickly. And then I played... Clover for a little while, and I was just like, I'm not really feeling it, you know what I mean? I, I like Pokemon Clover, it's funny, it does make me laugh and everything, but it's just not what I was feeling. And then the second I thought of Heart Gold Soul Silver, I was like, I gotta fucking play that. Because Fortune is my favorite gen. Heart Gold Soul Silver are my favorite uh, remakes and my favorite Pokemon games that are the main storyline. My favorite side games are Coliseum, we already played that playthrough. But these are my favorite, like, Pokemon games. Like, of all, 4th gen in general. After Heart Gold Soul Silver comes Platinum. That's how it is. But, we're gonna dive right into this because it is randomized, so everything's gonna be changed. Again, my name is Brad. If you wanna call me douchebag or whatever the fuck in the comments, feel fucking free. That's chill. But we're gonna dive right into this. Hopefully the audio sounds alright. It might be a tad bit loud, I'm not sure. Maybe not though. I don't I don't think so though. I think it should be good. I think I think we should be pretty solid. So let's dive right into this then. Like I said, that white line above the bottom screen will fade in. It's just for right now, it looks kinda weird. Uh we don't need any info. Oh, I gotta use my mouse. Okay, we'll use my mouse on parts like this then, that's fine. Hmm, interesting. Huh? Oh, excuse me, sorry. I was just reading this book here. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Oak, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like you to tell you I'd like you to tell me a few things about yourself. I'd like to know a few things. Okay, you, you get it. Oh, about this world, he wants to tell me a few things about the world, not myself. I read into that a little bit more. Sorry, guys. The world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together, and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. <laughs> with them. <laughs> now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Are you a boy or are you a girl? The fuck you think I am, dude? Now, see the beard? My beard looks really weird right now. Maybe that's what got him confused. Maybe, maybe girls have this little, like, shit right here. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know why it's doing that so much. And twist it in. Man, see, this looks weird. I'm going for like some demonic shit. My name, we are gonna go with Brad. I used to have a name for in-game avatars, and now it's just, we go with Brad. It's just easier. That is my name. Why are you ready? So I have to touch down here, I don't know what I was thinking. Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. Fun experiences, difficult experiences, there's so much waiting for you. Dreams, adventure, let's go to the world of Pokemon. I'll see you later. Ah, foreshadowing, huh, Professor Oak? I feel you. No, no, I feel it. So, we are indeed here. And is my config not set up? It may not be. Set up. I'm just using the wrong buttons. <laughs> oh, I fucking suck. Alright. <laughs> Let's talk to our mother. Hi, Brad. You're finally awake, and your friend Lyra was just here. She was playing hide and seek with her Meryl. Oh, I almost forgot. Our queen, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he had a favor to ask of you. You know where the lab is, right? It's right next door to us. By the way, do you have everything you need to go out? Here, use this bag to carry. Thank you very much. This is your trainer card. What up, TDH? This is your trainer card. Here, you can save a record of your progress. There are ra there are rather helpful options. Okay, I like. I really. I'm not, I was gonna keep that voice up, and I just don't care that much. I just don't care that much. Do we start with running shoes? I don't remember. We do not. In case you guys are wondering. Alright, so we gotta see Lyra play with her marrow. Sounds dirtier than it is. Oh, okay, it's on the screen. I was like, what are these all little black specks and shit? It's on the screen. <laughs> it's because the game's uh, emulated. So, I have not seen what they are randomized to. Um, I just dove in, and I was like, you know what? We're just going to hope it's actually randomized, and if i got to fix it, i got to fix it. 
You know anything about my research? As you know, Pokemon are carried in Pokeballs these days. But before the Pokeball was invented, people used to walk with Pokemon. Just like your friend Lyra does. Pokeballs are great because you can carry many Pokemon. But walking with Pokemon must have some advantages. It could have something to do with how Pokemon grow or evolve. So I'm gonna give you a Pokemon. Can you walk beside this Pokemon outside of its Pokeball to see if this brings any special feelings or bonds between Pokemon and people? The device over there has some Pokemon you could choose from. Well, thank you. Oh, dude, you're totally good, TDH. Don't even worry about it. Oh, hey, uh, okay. Hey, listen, I have this acquaintance that people call Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyways, I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It's probably another Pokemon egg, but we're still so busy with our Pokemon research. Wait, I know. You can go in our place, right? Can we count on you? You can choose one of the Pokemon over there. Oh, God, please be kind to me, Pokemon. What do we got, dude? Uh, okay, we got a Tentacruel. That's kind of cool. It's not bad. We got a Smoochum. Uh, probably not going to pick Smoochum. I'm not going to lie to you guys. And we got a Geodude. Well, out of those three, I'm going Tentacruel. Hell yeah, I'm actually pretty down for a Tentacruel. That's kind of cool. That's actually pretty cool. Let me see if I can fix this. Because now i got to change where the Pokemon is on here. So you guys can see it pop up on the layout. It's just how this playthrough is. That's how I did the last one too. And I want to stick with it. So we're going to do that. And then I think if I just do this. Boom. Look at Tentacruel right down there, dude. I wanted to clean it up a little bit from the Moon Wonderlock. Because during that one, I didn't, you know. You, you were saying Smoochum, TDH? Nah, bro, nah. I already picked Tentacruel, homie. Uh, what are we going to name him? Alright, TDH. Give me a... Nah, fuck the challenge. <laughs> Alright, TDH, give me a name. Since I didn't pick Smoochum like you wanted me to. Give me a name for Tentacruel. I'm feeling... Uh, we can go like Hentai. That could be kind of cool. Um, <laughs> I could go... Um, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think of this. So if we go like... We do like Nubs or Nubby. Nah, we'll go with Nubs. You like Nubs? Because <laughs> he has little Nubs. I'm going with Nubs. <laughs> like, I like Nubs. Is it bad? That's what I was typing. Were you typing Nubs? Nice, dude. <laughs> hey, we're on the same... Oh, Hentai. You're typing Hentai. <laughs> you can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, use this machine. I remember that part. Just check the PC on my desk. Mr. L. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is just past Cherry Grove City. Go north a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, Brad. Thank you. I keep trying to use the uh, analogs, and it doesn't work. Hey, you got some Pokeball or potions? Try potions. Okay, so the lock has not begun yet because this is a Nuzlocke. Nubs is better. I like Nubs, dude. Nubs is cool for him. It's nice and simple. I like simple names. You know what I mean? Don't say that you use a Pokemon for Pokemon's in danger. Yeah, don't forget to use a potion. I won't. Thank you. And the way these episodes are going to break down is they're going to be uh, one, ep one 15 minute episode and one 25 minute episode every single day. So people who want longer ones can have longer ones. People who want shorter ones can have shorter ones. And you can just kind of keep the story going as well. So you pick a Tentacruel. That's a cute Pokemon you have. Uh, when you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes, too. Oh, that's right. Why don't I show you to your mom? See ya. Nah, you can fuck off. I don't, I don't talk to my mom, dude. Hey, yo, dude. Meryl likes nubs, dude. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Alright. <laughs> Wait, Brad! Um, it, random NPC. I'm using my own voice. Wait a sec. Uh, I can't go out there yet, or what? Did you leave your pokey gear at home? You should ask your mom. <sighs> fucking douche. No, 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 TDH, sorry. For when I put it on YouTube afterwards, it's going to have 15 minute and, 30, and 25 minute episodes. I'm going to stream for like an hour and a half to two hours. Oh, Brad, that's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor Elm must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task for you, you say. What kind of task? I see. That sounds a little difficult. But when something, 
When someone makes that kind of request of you, it must be important. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot. Your poke gear has come in. Thank you. Yeah, no, I'm still going to stream for like an hour and a half, two hours uh, tonight just because it's 10 o'clock at night, but I'll be streaming for longer than that most nights. I just wanted to have a game I could play, and then I was going to stream a lot longer. It's just, I can't play Duel Links every single night, you know? As Softin calls, what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use the Poke Gear to make a phone to make a to make a phone call. To make a phone call. <laughs> Everyone say it knows it's cute, dude. It's cute as fuck, bro. Uh, yeah, I remember. You're still gonna tell me though. Just power on the Poke Gear. Touch the telephone button, okay? The names of people you can call are automatically registered. Just select one to give him or her a call. Wow, I can't believe it's so easy to make a phone call. All right, mom. Thanks. That actually sounds like my mother. That's the worst part. Is that she sounds like my mom? Yeah, I want to see how cute Nubs is, dude. Let's look at her. Let's look at her. Strongly defiant, uh, impish nature, which I think is half decent. Hmm, that's okay. <laughs> Put the special attack down. Uh, we got Poison Sting Supersonic, which Supersonic's great for catching Pokemon this low of a level. Make them hit themselves, and we can catch them. We're gonna play this a lot differently than we played Clover and the Moon Wonder Lock. We went, we went through that real quick. I'm gonna slow down for a minute. Wait one sec! I almost completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. Oh, shit. All right, dude, I'm a 10-year-old, I'm a, I'm a maybe 11, but I don't know. I'll take your number, homie. I'll call you if anything comes up. Well, we may as well see what's in the grass over here. Yeah, we can't catch it yet, so the nose lock has not started. That's terrible. <laughs> I did keep um, similar strength on, just so you guys know. I did not make it so anything would pop up because I don't want to get fucking bodied or something. You know what I mean? Actually, you know what? That wouldn't be half bad to get like a Tyrogue. And uh, yeah, that, that wouldn't be half bad. Why don't we start a little. Oh, I thought we were level 6. Never mind, we're good. Foresight. I don't think I can even speed up. So we're just enjoying battles for what they are in this one. Identified nubs. Well, that's good, dude. You gotta get to know me a little bit, man. Get all those nubs up on you, dude. You got nubs too, Tyro. Don't even lie. He's all acting like he ain't nubby. Uh, he ain't got nothing but for he ain't got nothing but fake out and force. I know. Sorry, Tyro. I appreciate it. Uh, I appreciate the experience, though. I'll have to change it to fast text. I forgot. Give me a break, man. It's been a long time since I played a fourth gen game. I don't even think about stuff like that, you know? Alright, get this Tyro out of here. Give me some experience. What do we got? 39 is pretty solid. We're gonna come across something like crazy as fuck in this grass. Alright, let me change that text actually. Key item in this bag. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Thank you. Okay, so we got nothing in our bag. Options. Text speed goes to fast, battle scene on, battle style, I'm going to keep shift. Uh, what kind of frame we want, green? Hey, look at that green, boys. Hey, what's up? Green's my favorite color. Alright. <laughs> right, we can see what else is in here, but we're going to see some stuff along the route, so. Cannot wait till we get the running shoes. Cannot freaking wait. Can't even tell you guys. Hey, how are your Pokemon if they're weak? Okay, thanks. Don't walk in the tall grass. I appreciate it, bud. Wow, I really want those running shoes. <laughs> That's a medium speed for text. That was really, really slow. Like, really, really slow. Oh, Pidgey, dude. Oh, yeah, no, dude. Son of Moo moves so fast compared to old school Pokemon games. Yeah. So fast. I got that poison, boys. Wild Pidgey use Tackle. Getting sketchy. I think we'll be okay, though. I am going to heal. Even though we won't get, like, uh, penalized. We don't have Pokeballs yet, so this Nuzlocke hasn't begun. But I'd prefer not to faint. 
I gotta see if I can get my beard to go back together right here. That's better. I don't know, it looks all weird with the line right down the middle, you know? It just keeps, like, it does it, like, naturally when I smile, it's like, yeah, I just spread separate. I don't know. I'm just talking, we got some time to talk in between moves and everything, so. <laughs> It feels really fucking cool to be playing this game, though. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. It feels, like, really, really cool. Um, I don't know which screen to look at, because I have it on both screens. So, we'll keep looking at this little one over here. Dude, tentacles? Dope! I actually like having tentacle. That's really different. I like that. Wants to take the lead. Alright, cool. Wants to take the lead? Are you singing now? Rolling around in the grass. <laughs> They do make it awfully cute. <laughs> I have nothing to put it in, okay. Can't just put it in my pocket, that'd be stupid. Certain Pokemon that appear in the morning, I forget. This has day and night cycles. And I don't think the rival battles yet. No, it's when we come back through. He hasn't stolen the Pokemon yet. Spoilers. Sorry. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then follow me. Yeah. Do I follow you automatically or do I have to actually walk with you? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot that you aren't wearing running shoes. I'll go as slow as possible. Try to keep it up. Thanks, man. This is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot. So you better learn about them. I ha I don't have the Pokewalker anymore, but I used to have it. I think it's broken, actually. I have one still, but I don't think it works anymore. This is a Pokemon Mart. They sell Pokeballs for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling there, Pokemon there. If you are if you go a little further, you'll see Mr. Pokemon's house. Well, thank you. That's, that's actually where I'm going, so I appreciate it, man. Could we just, like, stop right there? No. As you can see, this is the sea. This is the sea, as you can see. <laughs> Some Pokemon are found only in water. Well, thank you, man. I really, I appreciate it, bud. He's running, dude. He's an old man, dude. Here, it's my house. For your effort. Ah, give me my running shoes. Got it, did I? Don't worry, they're, they're brand new. Oh, okay, you got me. Gotcha. You got me, dude. Good fucking joke. Touch the sprint button to touch. Hold the B button to sprint. Uh, I think we'll actually probably just... We'll probably just lock it down so we're running all the time. I actually prefer that. I don't see why not. Yeah. Yeah, dude, look at that. We're fucking booking it, man. Let's go in here and heal up nubs real quick. Yeah, this really makes you, like, kind of appreciate Sun and Moon. Like, don't get me wrong, this game is still fucking dope. Like, it's not bad by any means. But with how fast-paced it is and everything, and how you just kind of get through stuff, you do appreciate it. I miss the Pokemon walking behind me. I always forget how much I miss it till I play these games. Like, genuinely. Oh, what's up, dude? <laughs> I made it! I forgot about one thing. This is another token for me. Take it. Hey, give me that map card, dude. Thank you. That's actually pretty fucking dope. Select the Poke Gear on the touch screen and then select the town map icon. You'll see the map of the region you're currently in. Ah, see? Spoilers. Hints. The Poke Gear becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate the luck. I really do. 